as we weave our stories into the grand narrative of human existence. We are not just adding our own threads to the tapestry, but we are also interpreting the stories of others, and in doing so, we are bringing our own unique perspectives to the table. This interpretive process is a vital part of the storytelling equation, for it's through this process of interpretation that we are able to uncover the deeper meaning and symbolism that underlies the stories we tell. As we delve into the world of storytelling, we are faced with the realization that our experiences, our perspectives, and our stories are all filtered through our own biased lenses. We are all subject to our own cultural, social, and personal biases, and it's through this recognition that we are able to approach storytelling with a sense of humility and empathy. We begin to see that our own stories, our own experiences, and our own perspectives are not the only ones that matter, but rather, they're just one thread in the rich and complex tapestry of human experience. The act of storytelling also acknowledges the impermanence of human experience. Our stories, our experiences, and our perspectives are all subject to change, to evolution, and to transformation. We are constantly growing, learning, and adapting. And it's through this process of transformation that we are able to tap into the deeper currents of the human experience. As we engage with the stories of others, we are not just listening to their experiences. We are also reflecting on our own. We are forced to confront our own assumptions, our own limitations, and our own biases. And it's through this process of self-reflection that we are able to grow, to learn, and to evolve as individuals and as a society. The act of storytelling also has the power to heal and to transform. It's a way of processing our emotions, of making sense of our experiences, and of connecting with others on a deeper level. It's a way of sharing our hopes, our fears, and our struggles with others, and of finding meaning and purpose in a complex and often overwhelming world. As we continue to tell our stories, to listen to the stories of others, and to weave our own experiences into the grand narrative of human existence, we are creating a tapestry of stories that's rich, diverse, and multifaceted. And it's in this shared act of storytelling that we find the true power of the human experience and the limitless potential of the stories that we tell, the stories that we hear, and the stories that we live. The stories we tell, the stories we hear, and the stories we live are all interconnected. And it's through this interconnectedness that we are able to tap into the deeper currents of the human experience. We are able to see the world through the eyes of others, to understand their struggles and triumphs, and to find common ground. And it's in this shared understanding that we find a sense of belonging, of connection, and of compassion. As we navigate the complexities of the human experience, we are constantly seeking answers to the great questions of existence. But the true power of storytelling lies not in its ability to provide definitive answers, but in its capacity to pose the right questions, to spark our imagination, and to ignite our curiosity. It's a power that sets us on a journey of self-discovery, of growth, and of transformation. And it's a journey that can change us transform us, and connect us to the world around us in ways that are both profound and transformative. In the end, storytelling is not just a means of entertainment or self-expression, but a fundamental aspect of the human experience. It's a way of making sense of the world, of processing our emotions, and of connecting with others. It's a way of sharing our experiences, our hopes, and our fears with others, and of finding meaning and purpose in a complex and often overwhelming world.